Hi, this is Buck here with Transit and Level Clinic, and today we're going to do a quick tutorial on how to change the IP configuration settings for the North Carolina VRS system. Uh, for those of you who have been using the North Carolina VRS system, you'll know that over the past week we've had some problems. This morning, the North Carolina Geodetic Survey uh, sent out information on a backup RTN system that we can now use until the uh, first system is up and running correctly. Uh, so we are making videos for each of the softwares that we do sell. Uh, our final video today is going to be on Like a Captivate. This is a fairly easy setting to change. If you open Like a Captivate up to its home screen, you'll go into the Settings tab, Connections, All Other Connections, and then you'll have two tabs here at the top. You'll have what we call CS Connections and GS Connections. You'll want to click on GS Connections and highlight the RTK Rover connection. Once you highlight the RTK Rover connection, if you have been using the North Carolina VRS system, you can simply go to the bottom of the screen, hit the control button. You will see your uh, current uh, network that you're connected to. Uh, in my case, I've called it NCGS. However, yours could be called other uh, names North Carolina VRS, VRS, etc. You'll click onto your network. This will come up with the server to connect. Simply go to the bottom of the screen, hit edit, and this is where we can change the information uh, that is needed to be changed. So the only setting that needs to be changed for right now is this current IP or web address that we're using. For those of you who have been on the network, you'll know that you use rtn.nc.gov normally. We're going to click on that and we're going to change it to our backup IP address. That backup IP address is 199.90.60.130. From here, click into the blank space, hit store, and then OK all the way out back to the home screen. From here, you should be able to connect uh, with no problem. If for some reason you do have problems, simply reboot the data collector, try again, and it should work. If you have any questions, please contact our office at 919-467-7782 or by email at sales at transitandlevel.com. Thank you.